Shalom Aleichem and welcome to the DHC, the Daily Halachic Corner. Next week, with the help of Hashem, we're going to be celebrating Hanukkah. So, we shall be speaking in the next future corners about the different laws of Hanukkah. A person wants to buy a new Hanukkah. He's debating between a more valuable Hanukkah and between a Hanukkah that looks nicer. For example, a silver Hanukkah that's not very pretty, but costs a lot of money, and a beautiful glass or crystal Hanukkah, which looks much nicer, but is not as valuable. What is more important? Value or beauty? According to the Gemara in the Yerushalmi, in chapter 6, section 1, value is more important than beauty. Therefore, he should buy the more valuable Hanukkah, a silver Hanukkah, even though it doesn't look as nice. But according to the Gemara in the Bavli, in Tractate Baba Batra, on the fourth page, first side, beauty is more important than value. And where do we learn this from? The Gemara tells us that when Hordus built the second temple, at the beginning, the second temple's outer walls were made of blue marble. Stones were inlaid, making it look like sea waves. Now, Hordus built it in such a way because he wanted to cover it with gold. And then the Torah sages of that age came to him and said to him, don't cover it with gold. It looks so beautiful, this blue marble looking like waves of the sea. Leave it as it is. Even though an outer gold covering is much more expensive and more valuable, nevertheless, the Torah sages preferred beauty over value. So according to that opinion, beauty is more important, and therefore a person should buy a glass or a crystal Hanukkah that's less valuable but prettier in his eyes. So in other words, we see that according to some value is more important, according to some beauty is more important. So what does that mean? That means that whatever Hanukkah you buy, it's absolutely perfect. Just make sure that it's something that either looks very nice in your eyes or something that is valuable and honors the actual litter. Until our next corner where we shall be speaking again about the laws of Hanukkah, may the blessing of the Torah be upon you.